I'm Melissa Snover, the Managing Director and Founder of the Catches Magic Candy Factory. We're the world's first ever 3D printer for candy and also the only 3D food printer to ever be launched into the consumer retail market. So 3D printing technology um, has come out of patents in 2012, and that really caused an explosion for the development of it in all sorts of different parts of the market. But food is one of those, which is really still, I believe, underdeveloped. The Magic Candy Factory does a lot of really important things by way of making that technology easy to use so that the mainstream market consumer can actually use it, enjoy it, and see what it's like to watch something they created come to life before their eyes. The long-term possibilities for this innovation across all types of food are kind of endless. The idea that you would be able to create one day a food with different ingredients inside, but which had the taste, mouthfeel, texture, appearance of something that might be bad for you, but was made from protein and vitamins, uh, would in effect, I think, end obesity. Um, the idea that you could have biosensors in your arm that would feed information to a food printer that would basically engineer a food that would be specifically perfected for your nutritional requirements. Um, these are seeming a little bit futuristic now, but we're not far away from it. I think the Magic Candy Factory is the first step. Get the customer used to this idea of 3D printed food, the fact that it's actually really enjoyable and wonderful and not uh, scary and, or t overly technical in any way. And then the next step is different types of food. And of course, protein will play a large part in that.